Hello everybody. This is Candace. I know you haven't seen me out here before, but this is my first YouTube video. Yay! I finally decided to take the Nest T plunge and jump. Do you hear me? Jump. I've been wanting to do this for so long and I've been watching all the planet girls, the planet babes such as Kita, Tarshell, E. Michelle, just to name a few, and they have really inspired me this year to just jump as far as this platform. I thought it would be befitting to start off with my 2019 planner lineup. I know that I'm late, but it's still January, so I think I'm good. Um, in this video, I'm not going to really do a flip through, which if you guys want to see a flip through, let me know. I'll kind of, you know, go in depth and my goal is to be as transparent with you as I can. But I just want to get you all acquainted with me, let you know who I am, kind of my planner style, which I'm still trying to figure that out for 2019. I mean, we just get evaded with so many spreads, so many sticker books, so many planners. I mean, I don't, the only thing I don't have is Erin Conjuring. Which, I mean, the recollection suffices for me, but um, that's probably the only planner that I don't have as far as the major ones. Um, but again, I'm going to take you through my planner lineup for 2019. I'm still tweaking it. I just wanted to keep the same setup for January as to see, you know, what works for me and what doesn't work for me. So stay tuned. And because I'm a newbie, you know I have to throw that in there. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe to me. I promise to bring you good quality content. So if I'm a little nervous, that's because it's my first time doing it. But we gonna make it through it. Don't y'all talk about me too bad. And um, later on, I plan to give a whole uh, introductory to me. I'll be on the camera and let you see my face. But right now, you're going to see the hands. It's Tarshell twerk, 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 twerk. Anyway, let's get on with this. So, I'm going to start from smallest to biggest. And I'm one of them girls that I have a million effing planners. And so, even though I be trying to consume all of my paper and use all of my products, it's getting to be overwhelming. So, this year, I did take a different approach. But when you see my lineup, you're going to be like, that doesn't look any different than having multiple planners. But it is. Just wait till you see. So, this is my mini. I changed this out. I used to have the cover on it with the um, latch. So, um, I had this... Um, this cover since the beginning of last year and I really didn't use it. So I thought I would, you know, switch it up. I'm going to change these discs, but you know how it gets when you have to go through putting all this back in. I haven't done it yet. I did buy some more discs and I'll be changing that out as well. Anyway, this is my mini catch-all planner and uh, this is what I'm using for 2019. I had the, uh, the Glam Girl since last year and of course I didn't I haven't put a name on it but I'm repurposing it as you can see I'm just doing a flip through I'm repurposing it and um um changing dates as I go um to be honest with you this is what January most of January no I'm sorry this is December so this wasn't the glam girl yet this was my old one. This, which one was this? I think this was, because uh, I had to keep covering it up, Sugar and Spice. That's what this was, the colorful one. So anyway, this month, as you can see, I'm using the Glam Girl Mini. Um, haven't, you know, really had no problems. I like the fact that it's neutral. And um, if you can tell, I haven't planned for this week because I've been so busy. Today, which is the day that I'm filming, filming is actually the 23rd. So I'm going to get caught up with that tonight. Um, sometimes it'd be like that. Normally, I try to plan on Thursday and Sundays. I, I do my weekly reset and finish my planning that I didn't finish on Thursday. So this is my mini. Um, in this, like I said, it's a catch-all. Just stuff that I have or appointments that I have 
things that I just need to hurry up and jot down. Uh, I also track my spending every day. So as you can see, which I took the other one out, but every day I track my spending. I track my spending. And as you can see, these are receipts, <laughs> which these, Michaels, Joanne, y'all know the y'all know the receipts is <laughs> uh, kind of normal to see in my planner because I'm like, uh, how many times? Oh, Target. You know where we run to all our favorite stores. Anyway, I haven't quite got this together, but this is one of the envelopes. This is the uh, uh, Miss Craftmaker uh, envelope. And I just have some rulers, some pullouts. I think these are some recollection stickers as far as on the go. And I think this was um, a freebie in the order that I placed. And I know, I don't know about y'all, but anytime I see cute little cards, I'll ask them, can I have them? I got the lady at Steinmar. She looked at me like I was crazy. She said, well, it won't have no money on it. I said, I know, I just want it. Because it's cute, so I can use it for my washi tape. <laughs> so, anyway, our obsessions. Um, this is another uh, sticky note uh, dashboard that I put in here. Because I'm a sticky girl. Oops, 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 oops. Shh, as you can see, shh. I'll probably blur that out if it shows up. But anyway, this is just my notes section. And that has personal stuff in the back. Um... What was this? Some cards that I had cut up. Did I make anything on this? No. That's in case I want to make some journaling cards. I put a few in there. And then um, those are the stickers that come with it. Uh, oh, because I have this back here. Um, some projects, daily projects that I want to get done. Um, today's focus sheets, little filler paper sheets. And um, those stickers go with this monthly which i haven't used because i have it in my big planner like i said if you all want to flip through i'm more than happy to do that but i just love paper i've been a paper girl all my life and um that's it this pen my sister gave me for christmas it's cute i just use it for decorative so that's that oops we gonna have to uh cut that out So that is that. That's the mini catch-all. And as you can see, she's chunky. I need to clean it up. I got some tabs, but I'm going to redo all of this. Okay, so mini chunky. This right here. Oh, and I did make this charm, by the way. This one, of course, you know, comes from Michael's. But this one I made, it has the uh, Hope. Uh, I think these charms, where did I get these from? Michaels? Yeah, probably. If I can get them turned around. Hope. Dream. Oh, faith. <laughs> and then I have a little pooch, so I put the paw, uh, the paw down there. Uh, I thought I had four of them. No. And then I put these little... I don't know what you call them, but they just dangly, so I could have a long one. And I put a little uh, pearl, so it's cute. And I have this one because the cover that I used to have was the teal blue one, so I'll probably have to change that out. But just like to hear it jingle. <laughs> uh, the next one that I have, I'm not really gonna flip through it because uh, this is kind of when I started doing the uh gtd i started doing this probably about i'm gonna say maybe over a year ago i i didn't know what i ran across when i went to half price books but um i had bought the book and that's how i got into it and now since i've you know really been into uh the planning community it's a whole big deal with getting things done so initially i started off with uh just stuff that I wanted to do as far as like go to declutter. And these came from Staples, these project sheets. And um, I need to do all this because it's clearly 2019 now. But uh, I had made these dashboards for myself. 
So I decided to break it up. And um, this is just, ooh, it just came out. As you see, that didn't work out as far as the hole punching, but it works for now. This is just where I'm documenting things. Um, as stuff comes to mind, I kind of keep this with me and jot it down. If I completed it, then um, I highlight it so I know that I'm done. Uh, let me take this out because this is where I left off on that part. I was writing in it the other night. Uh, let's see. This one is an inbox as far as financial things. Um, so any um, ideas as far as my business, which I have a, a women's boutique. I had a brick and mortar, but I closed it down and I ended up uh, going mobile. So I have a mobile truck. And um, like, like I said, as you guys get to know me, you'll get to know more about all that. But the different things for my business ideas. So I don't really want to show that right now, but just thoughts that pop up. Um, this section, oh, and by the way, green is my favorite color. Uh, this is general notes and research. This is when I find something, I have an idea, and I'm trying to figure it out. I understand it. Um, I just write down different notes. And um, with the art system from Staples, I kept this in here because it kind of gives you a little idea of all that they offer as far as their inserts. So I kept that, and this is art paper too. I'm kind of a neutral girl. I do like the colored stuff, but I always fit. I always find myself going back to like natural, neutral colors, and I mean that's just for some reason. And this is just a little pouch. It has some little paper clips. Um, these look like these came from uh, Joann's. And uh, these stickers, which I had bought these to uh, use it like as like bullet points, but they're not worth anything. I don't even like them. I probably need to pull them out. So again, this is my GTD book, and I just put the little cross embellishment on it. Nothing spectacular, um, which I'll probably redo this again because I want to update the dashboards. As you can see. Um, when I laminated it, it came a little bit over. So I'm going to get all that neat. But nobody knows what your hairdresser. I'm not worried about that. It's still mine. It still works. And it's still functional. Which I'm a functional planner. So that was the second one. Um, This one is, I guess, kind of a brain dump book too. Um, this has my ideas. Um... Just different things. I like Jeopardy, so these are um, stuff that I want to brush up on. Yeah, I was a geek in school as to the reason why I love planners. But uh, uh, some stencils, uh, some stickies. That was a pen test. Just seeing how it wrote. Some of the little mini half sheets that I have in here. Tombow pens, the Stettler, Faber Castell, Paper Studio, Uniball. So that's that. Um, just different ideas. Um, and this actually, this, look, I'm crazy. Random shit. <laughs> ah, you'll find that I'm a cusser. I don't mean to cuss, it's just me. And uh, I hope you don't take any harm, but I'm going to be me. Um, but this. The, this book came about when they created the Happy Notes. And I don't know about y'all, but I'm, I live in Louisville, Kentucky. So it's like we don't get anything when the, when it's released. And I mean, it, it really pisses me off. My sister's a planner, babe, too. So, I mean, we done got to the point where we're not even trying to go around. We just wait until it hits and it's saturated after everybody done got the bill. So I really wanted those Happy Notes. Uh, happy planner books so i was like you know what i got all this uh filler paper why don't i make my own a uh, duh shop your stash shop your stash so um like i said a lot of this i can't really show um as far as my inventory and it's just uh more filler paper my wish list different things i have uh 
so many papers and notes everywhere. My goal in 2019 is to really completely get organized. And my mother, she thinks I'm crazy, but she doesn't understand the whole idea of this planner stuff. I guess the fun in it and the challenge is, is to really get your life organized. I mean, that is such a goal of mine. I'm talking about from home decluttering to paper decluttering. Now, I'm still a paper girl, so I probably will never be completely digital, but I am digital on some platforms. However, that is the whole challenge to see how efficiently and effectively you can organize your life. So that's that book. Let me put that back up. I'm not going to keep you guys too long. I just wanted to show you my planner lineup. Let me move these out. Those over there. My next one is my Transformer Planner. I've seen this a while ago. I can't give credit to who did it. Um, I know everybody's doing it now, but I've seen this a while ago and set mine up this way because, again, excuse me, I need to drink some of my water. My mouth is a little parched. So, yeah, I've seen somebody do this a while back, and I thought it was really neat. So, if I knew who it was, I would give them credit, but... Um, I just don't know. So this right here, initially I had two business um, planners. And the reason I did is because I wanted to keep them separate. But again, like I said, it was getting overwhelming. So this one really isn't my business planner no more. This one contains my work planner. Uh, what else? Work food, exercise, and wellness, and what else? My faith, and I feel like I'm missing something else. But anyway, this is that. This is my transformer. So when you open it up, and yes, I did put the covers on it. So this one, when you open it up, as you know, it transforms. And it's fat. I'm going to have to get this down. When I pull January out, um, it'll probably, you know, go down. Like I said, I'm trying to get my set up. So this is my work planner. And for this one, I'm not really uh, decorative because it's my work planner. And also, I try to use it as um, a means of tracking what I do daily. I'm an IT analyst, so uh, I'm just flipping through it real quick. Um, this is this week, but I haven't, you know, uh, I'm just flipping through it daily. And sometimes I don't keep up with it. That's just how it goes in the planet world. I mean, again, you're just trying to use your paper. This one, which I'm struggling with, like a lot of you all, is the um, mom planner. Let me transform it. This is my household and just things that I need to do around the house. So, uh, again, declutter project. This is, um, I'll sit down and plan tonight my spread for this week. And um, just, again, just trying to find a way to use this. Um, I do like the errands. I do like to, the to buys. Um, sometimes I use the call and email. Sometimes I don't. I mean, you're not stuck to the predefined platforms, but this right here, it's not enough room for me to write. I'm a writer. You know what I'm saying? I see some people, they can put just one word and know what it means. I mean, I could do that, but I'm a writer. I like to write. And this, it conforms me. It keeps me bound. Just like it ends up. Where is it at? I'm trying to make sure I'm not exposing anything. I'm going to have to get better about that. But uh, it keeps me to a line. And I don't like that. I don't like that. Um, so the next one. This is my um, this is my little sticky notes from when I was trying to 
decide how I was going to set this up so I know what each section was for. This is my wellness and exercise. And um, if you follow me on Instagram, I'm Candyland Plans 99. So I created that to track my daily water go. I love water. So look, you can never have enough water. Um, and then I also created this weight loss tracker. I need to lose some weight. I play basketball and I'm a uh, athlete, but over the years of having a sit down job, your girl has picked up some weight. So we can really get this off of us in the 2019. So, um, I haven't really been keeping up with this. As you can see, I put some little meal plans in there and, um, I'm going to try to get better. And this is my wellness, which I've fallen off. As you can see, I try to use my monthlies for little challenges, like do one thing that makes you feel good, get outside and connect because I work from home. Look in the mirror and say, I love you. I love you, Candice. You know, I really do. I love you and you and you and you, you, you. <laughs> so anyway, and I was trying to figure out because I hate for paper to go to waste. Um, I'm not going to show what my thoughts are, but um, I find little prompts on uh, Pinterest and what are you having a hard time accepting? Write a love letter to yourself. How can you create space for love? And this is this week's, which I got to do tonight. And I haven't dated it. Again, it's a lot to keep up with. But if you're a real planner, babe, this stuff, this is my my happy place. When I'm sitting in my bed sometimes or at my desk or at my table, because eventually you're going to get a tour of my crafting areas. And they're not just limited to one spot. They're everywhere. <laughs> Lord, I'm like, this year, is. I'm going to really have to try to do a no spin. But they're talking about a new release as far as Happy Planner in March, which I heard that it was leaked through Joann's. I went and looked, and um, they have the pictures as far as some of the sticker books out there. But you can't order. It says not, a, not available, not in stock. So, you know, I was trying to get in on the good foot. So that's that. <laughs> but I'm saying you going to go broke. But you know us planner braves, we don't pay a full price for nothing. So again, I will wait until it's marked down or it's thoroughly saturated. Everybody done got their feel of it. And then I'll wait for my 50% off, my $10 day, or whatever day, 20% on top of whatever. Joanne's 40% off with a 20% coupon. I'll wait. And then I'll get them. I'll get them. Don't worry. I might be a little in the Left Behind series, but it ain't no whole lot of. So anyway, this is my faith planner. And we're going to transform it again. Bam! This, I love this planner right here. And yes, by the way, I'm a horizontal girl. I'm trying to come into it with the, uh, um, as far as the uh, vertical stuff. But this is my Bible study challenge. And this one is built on, is it? Oh, finding peace. So what I do, which I've done all of these, what day am I up to? Uh, where did I left off on the 14th. So you see, I got some catching up to do. Yeah. So basically what I do is I read these verses all of these pertain to finding peace because my goal is to find peace within 2019. I'm going to quit letting everybody control and dictate my life. Your girl, I got peace, but I'm really going to find my peace. So I thought that was, you know, something, a, a study challenge that would really, you know, do me some good. And it has um, just having that time with the Lord. And I accidentally wrote on this backwards. So every day I'm kind of writing the verse. And um, this is the new sheet. And just reflecting, just challenges. Um, this I haven't been keeping up with for real. As you see, I decorate it. And got to do this week. Got to do this week. I'm behind. Cause, and being that it's already February, this week is going to be hectic. Because I'm going to have to do monthlies. 
And so I think that's it. Yep, that's my February. And uh, these are just notes when I go to church, different things that I study. Uh, do, 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 do. Notes, notes. Let's see, stickers. We're at the end, yeah. So this is my uh, transformer planner. That's my transformer. Okay, we got two more to go. And I'll be done. Now, this one is my baby right here. She's thick. All of mine are thick, too. They all thick. Let me move this out the way. I'm going to drink some up first. Oh. As you can see, uh, this is my baby right here. And that's my... I make some um, vinyl stickers, but I ended up putting it on something else. Um, this is for my sister, but uh, I had made one for this, but I ended up using it somewhere else, and uh, I need to make a new future log, but this one has it, I believe. Let me see. Yeah, this one has it, the future log. This has the future log, so I like this. That's why, I, and I love these colors. The only thing about it is with these um, pages, the weekly pages, I mean, again, that's why I end up going back to just plain Jane stuff. I rather, I mean, the colors and all that excites me, but as far as being functional for me, I think I'm a plain Jane girl. I mean, it's not, it's not to say that I'm still not going to buy any that have colors, but... I, I really wish, you know, even though there is a theme for the planner that on the pages, they would kind of slow down with all that decoration. And I guess it's good for those who don't really, you know, want to do all that and just need something to spruce up the page. So, um, I mean, it's a win-lose situation sometimes. And this is the dashboard. I haven't really used it. I got caught up on that hype. Um... This section right here is kind of like my financial goals. Like I said, I'm not going to do a, fi a flip through accomplishments. Uh, this is my mood tracker. And um, those those sheets that uh, uh, we got in the, the teacher um, accessory planner, uh, this is what I use that for. And so I track different things on the side and my mood. And so I'm almost done. It's uh, tonight I'll have to fill that in and finish coloring in. And again, it's just relaxing. So that's that. These are like my main trackers and master to-do list, uh, accomplishments, stuff like that. Uh, this is December, but I didn't finish this one. And again, see, I got it. This one, I just been trying to figure out my flow. So this one isn't decorative. I'm just trying to keep up with what I'm doing. So this is my word of day. I use the uh, monthly uh, one for that. And just to give a flip, bam. Uh, accomplishments, things I want to focus on. Uh, my daily to-dos. I try to write down the top six things I need to do each day. So this is January, which I didn't label. But uh, yeah, that's that. And so, like I said, I'm going to have to purge some of this because I was ha needing to refer to December, um, you know, for what all I was doing just to, you know, and this is my budget area, which is the vertical. So, da -da 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 -da, that's December. Hold on. And I will be doing a, a budget with me because I'm trying to get out of debt. Your girl is trying to get out of debt for show, for show, for sure. So these are my spreads. I'm just kind of flipping quick uh, because, you know. And so these are some of my lists and some of the things that I need to do. This is uh, this week. And uh, that's that, the budget part. Um, I used to use this faithfully. I'm sorry if you hear that scraping. I have a... Um, limb that's done uh fell 
or it's broken and it's scraping against my window. So um, my uh, handyman, he'll be over this weekend to cut that back. But I used to use this religiously. This is the uh, extension budget, just some of my bills. Um, like I said, I haven't been um, really doing this, this setup because I have my own sheets that I make, which you'll see right here. I made this for my bill pay list. This is November. Let me see where my extra ones. Oh, it's probably up there, but I make my own. I write down all my bills because your girl got bills. And the months, if it's a business expense, if it's an auto, um, get your income, cash envelopes. I do do cash envelopes. I probably should have showed y'all that too. And then um, the same thing on the back. And it just kind of helps me keep up, which I keep the uh, uh, confirmation numbers of when I pay something. And this, and these are like all my bills. I need to update this list. Um, but uh, this month, did I, that's why. That is why. Where is it at? Let me see, y'all. That's why. I missed the bill. I call it a late fee. I am pissed off about that. Uh, Oh, I thought I had it. Maybe I didn't do one for January. Oh, that's probably why, because I was going to use this. But this didn't. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I got to go back to my sheet. Yeah, I missed one right here. I had a, a credit card payment due on the 10th for Capital One. And last night I was going through, you know, just doing my bills, balancing my ledgers, because I keep an electronic ledger. And I'm like, oh, hell to the no. I don't forget to pay Capital One. So your girl done incurred a $27 late fee. And you can't be losing uh, money like that. You know what $27 gets you in the planet world? What? A whole lot. <laughs> That's an envelope, another dashboard. I might end up taking that out because um, just some stickers that I put in here. Not much. The ones that come with the extension pack. Um, and this I can't show that has, uh, uh, important information and passwords, but, oh, here's the ones. These are my templates. I just keep a few back here. So when I'm, um, it's fill of paper extras, just extra stuff. So, but here they are. I created these and I printed them out on a few different colors. So, I can have them available each month as I do my bills. And you guys will probably see me do this very shortly because February is upon us. So, and these rings, I still twirl them, but with all this stuff, it's hard closing. Excuse me. Excuse me, excuse me. Like I said, if you want detailed flip throughs, I can really do that for you. That's no problem at all. And last but not least is my Big Happy Planner. Now, this month, I didn't use it because I was trying to, like I said, go for consolidating everything into one. But this, I, like I said, I like to write. I like to write. This was my um, catch-all uh, household, everything regarding my house. Um, put them over there. But, um, yeah, that's me and my mom, just in case. That's my mother. She gonna kill me for showing y'all that, but that's me and my mom. I think I still need to uh, finish setting this up, which I do. That's me. That's her. That's me again. <laughs> Candace. And I had put these in there. I, I was going somewhere with that, but didn't finish. I'll have to finish that um these were some little envelopes that i was making just playing around with some of the decorative paper and of course you need your pouch more stickles stickles on stickles on stickles um this little dashboard some little posties do y'all keep these i had made my sister had given me this paper and i thought it was cute 
So I had made that. I'm going to have to revamp all of this. But do y'all keep y'all sticky notes on here? Do y'all keep your sticky notes on there? <laughs> I mean, I done did the whole, putting the whole sticky notes on dashboards. But when you're done with them, that double-sided tape, it takes an act of Jesus to scrub it and get it out. And sometimes I want to reuse them for something else. So I got my meal plan. These is like my extras. Um, this I'll probably pull out because I've already... Uh, done some of my goals but i gotta finish my goals for 2019 this was that happy planner sheet that uh the happy planner the free printable they gave out of course it, 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 i bleh, i didn't uh, use this one i did use it in a mini but i can probably take that out these are my measurements for when i'm you know making different stuff so again this is 2018 i'm gonna need to purge this purge 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 and let's see. January, as you can see, I haven't done nothing. So this is December. I will get back into it because that mom planner just isn't working for me. It isn't working. And I need space. And as you can see, some some weeks it's just hard. Some weeks I stamp. I mean, it just depends. Some weeks it's just minimal. And as you can see, that's when I fell off during Christmas. But I'm going to get back to this because um, I miss my big happy planner. planner. Um, yeah, I, and that's the big monthly uh, extension pack. These, I don't care how long I had these this forever, and it's still hard turning stuff. Um, this is a dashboard. See, now like this, because I'm a sticky note girl. I need sticky notes. Uh, I had created this um, just out of some old pads that um, I had, you know, just to use your stuff up. And uh, this is the uh, Petrina Spears. I was doing this for a while. I think I, did, I tore that, but I'm going to leave it alone. Did I, did I make it? Yeah, I made that. But it's the Seven Day Abundance Journal. It's pretty good. If I can um, find that link to that video. Um, it's just basically manifesting who you are and your life um, from the light of God I am. Just speaking uh, positivity into your life. And it's daily affirmations that you do each week in your journal. So I had printed out a few of them. I did it for a few weeks, but as you know, I fell off. I fell off. I'm not even going to lie. And just some notes, more uh, pen tests. So, yeah, um, this can come out. Let me pull this out now. And see, that's his name, David Allen. Getting things done. I mean, collecting, processing, put it where it belongs, review it, and simply do it. And so I'm really trying to get into practice of, which I've kind of been that girl, but I'm trying to get into the practice of, um, I can use this for scrap. Oh, it's double sided. I printed double sided. Well, I'm going to have to throw it away. Put it in my paper that I printed, and it's got blank on one side. I keep it at my computer desk to jot notes. Let me know if you're terrible like that. I, I just hate wasting paper. But uh, yeah, guys, that is my 2019 planner lineup. And like I said, if you want a more in depth look and uh, <coughs> excuse me, feel, <coughs> excuse me, if you want a more in-depth feel and a flip through of my planners, I'll be more than happy to do that for you. Um, again, I want to introduce myself and say, hey, y'all, it's your girl, Candy Kane. So I got so many names, but for the most part, I'm the dysfunctional functional. And again, like I said, Excuse me, I have a tickle in my throat. If you want to follow me, make sure you hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. Go ahead and give me thumbs up, y'all, if y'all like this video. Again, I'll be bringing you new content here shortly, and eventually I'll be doing an introduction and let you see me and get to know me. Once I build up a few followers, 
um, and those who like my content. I'll start doing some lives so we can chit chat y'all and have a little planner fun. But until then, I won't keep you guys. You all have a lovely, lovely night. Don't do nothing I wouldn't do. Keep your nose clean. And until then, deuces.